as you can see, I've got my generator shed open. So uh, it's that time of year where what I'm going to do is actually blow the dust out of the generator shed and connect up my power and gas line for the winter so I'll be at the ready. So let's uh, get it done. So, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run the power out the back and plug it in. I got this cover right here, so I'm going to poke the power. I'm in the northeast and it's getting colder here, so that's my 50 amp service box that's tied into my panel in the uh, basement. And this is the plug that I'm going to put in there and it's going to screw down and seal itself up. So we open this up. And that's not going anywhere. So that's that piece done. That's very simple. That's a very expensive cable, by the way. Which if you have a generator and you go to do one, you'll know. I converted this generator when I bought it over to natural gas and there's a regulator there. I wanted to have a solution where I wouldn't have any problems getting fuel for this thing when I needed it. Come on, where are you? I'll push the gas hose out right here. Okay. As you can see, there's a gas hose coming out. I'm just going to pull that out and over to the gas hookup which is right there.
All right, and we're just gonna plug the gas line in. And take the cap off of it. That's the gas line. I think this is a three quarter inch gas line. I'm just gonna connect it. Just pull the collar back and connect it. And that's it. That's all set for the winter. Now at this point, I've got a couple of more things to do. At this point, I've got a couple of more things to do. So I'm going to uh, 